Welcome to the project demonstration of medicine delivery robots by using Arduino Uno. So here the main purpose of this project is whenever you want to deliver the medicines to the like uh, isolated patients uh, in ICU then uh, instead of sending a person personally to deliver the medicines so we are going to send this robot uh, near to the bed and then it will announce the voice with the help of API 33A3 to inform to the respective patient to take the medicine and till he uh, took the medicine the system keep on announcing the voice so that will be identified with the help of this IR sensor so three IR sensors meant for three patient beds and whenever it reaches the stage one so we are going to place uh, one line following system so this system uh, this robot system has the four IR sensors under this robot body so these uh, four IR sensors are used to follow the line following and also to find the stages means near the bed stages. So whenever the first stage is uh, identified, so these are the three uh, four IR sensors we mounted under this body of this robot. And uh, whenever the first patient uh, bit reaches, then uh, the system uh, identify that and it will inform to the patient one if we select that from the blink application. So from this blink application we are going to inform to the robots about to which uh, bed it has to uh, in a, announce the voice of the taking medicine. So from anywhere in the world we can select this. So initially it is showing the red icon on this Arduino symbol as it is showing that the system is offline. So when we select this bed 1 so then the uh, system start moving from his stage and it will re after reaching the stage 1 it means near to the bed 1 then it will check that if we place the medicine in this cup then it will keep on announcing the voice till the patient took this cup once it took the cup a, uh, the robot uh, stop announcing and it start moving so it will complete the total circle 1 2 3 and after that it will consider as a zero position again so once it reaches zero position it will wait for the command so in this project one more feature is like we can select the three beds at a time or one or three so then based on the input only it will follow the line and after reaching the respective stage selected by the user then only it will announce the voices so here the total components are like we are using arduino uno and uh, seven ir sensors three ir sensors for medicines and four ir sensors for line following and next esp8266 module to get the input from the blink application and APR 33A3 that is uh, audio playback recorder module to play the predefinedly recorded voices so if he uh, coded the voices like two voices one is a welcome message and the next is the please take the medicine for the patient end. and the whole system driven by this 12 volt 3 amps battery pack so here we can observe that so we can see three batteries are connected in series and remaining three battery packs are connected in parallel so each battery uh, consists of 4 volt 1 amp and remaining uh, 3 are totally 4 volt 1 amp into 3 total 12 volts we will get that so in order to recharge the battery so we need to connect the B at this B slot and next T at this T slot and then uh, switch on the transformer so when you switch on that there is a light indication so it will be, uh, it will be fully charged in the duration of 10 hours at least after that so we can utilize that for uh, demonstration purpose the main on off switch is this is the main on off switch and the next there we are using two regulator circuits so those are LM317 regulators as we are using IR and Wi-Fi module so these uh, modules are high power consumption devices so that we need to use the high current regulators so that the system will work flawlessly and remaining one more two boards are there this side one more board and that that side also one more board so those boards are used as a breadboards in order to distribute this 5 volts power supply which is coming out of from this LM317 regulators to the IR modules and Arduino and API 333 module and the next one more IC is there we can see this is the L293D motor driver so the purpose of this L293D motor driver is to control the robot in four directions when we are controlling on the line following system so let us see the demonstration before switching on the kit we need to enable the hotspot in your phone so for that go to hotspot settings of your phone and change the hotspot name to project 5164 and the password should be 12345689 
So after that, on the R spot, on the data, and log into the Blink application. So let us see the demonstration on floor directly. So right now, let's check on the floor. So once when you switch on this cage, so we need to hold this reset switch till the system connected to the Wi-Fi. So then we can see that the mobile phone or uh, like medicine robot is connected. So after that only you can release the switch. Right. Right. So that's a welcome message. And now I'm going to select the with the duration of one second. Bed one. System starts. So I'm select bed two and bed three also. So take the medicine. So till you took the medicine, it will keep on announcing that. Right. Right. So till you took the medicine, it's continuously announced that. This is cool. So we can see that there is a light indication also. So light indication for patient three and previous also we observed that. Right, now you can take the medicine. So done, it's completed. So now uh, place the medicine for uh, bed one and we'll select only one again. So now we just start moving that. So this is going to be zero position for the robots. Again, right. So now the system again, it will till reaches the stage the three. So it keep on announcing that. Keep on moving, right? Thank you.